Greetings and salutations, exiles. This video is a after action review of sorts. Um, just kind of summarize some of the stuff that happened over the course of the last couple of hours. So today was one of those days, you know, it's Sunday, and I don't get the opportunity to, to raid on the on the regular weekday because I, you know, I have a job, a career, I have things I attend to. And so I'm, I'm not able to, and usually I, I you know, unfortunately, uh, I, I kind of get uh, the short end of the stick a lot of times on the on the rating. And so every every day this week, I've been raided by the Chinese, and I don't I don't actively mess with them. I mean, I don't like go out and raid their stuff. I I usually spend most of my time farming and socializing. But um, so this has been this side's been raided uh, three times, and I, I've done a couple of videos of it. And so every time I go through and I make it thicker and thicker and thicker and this this starts to speak to certain game mechanics that have deficiencies because you know ultimately what what is enough like what is unpenetrable what 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 do you cross before you're like okay obviously explosions are too powerful if they can get through 10 foundations of walls and that's that's kind of what I have here, and so um, it, it was it was seven thick here, and then you can see I don't know if you can see it, um, but there there's uh, fences in between. So you have seventy. So basically, you would have hundred thousand, seventy thousand, a hundred thousand, seventy thousand, a hundred thousand, seventy thousand, a hundred thousand. So that's like that's over an over a million hit points. They have to get through to get through this, and um, it, it only took them. Uh, I think it only took them. If I go to my logs um, and I go to event log, right, and we're gonna go. Um, let's go short. So we're gonna go building system, and we can see that we can see that. Uh, oh, thralls pets. Um, they started. Uh, I guess it's not going to show me. I thought it would show me. Um, well, if I go to thralls and pets, uh, apparently it says that I've only lost. Oh, let me expand this out. Let me see if I expand this out. So I lost one, two. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty one, twenty two, twenty three, twenty four, twenty five, twenty six, twenty seven. 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38. I lost 38 uh, thralls and animals today from ultimately one, and this, this is kind of speaks to what my one, one, one of my talking points is going to be. So I'll transition to this in a minute, but I lost 38 creatures and really of those 38 uh only a couple of them were animals i had two scorpions and four, uh i guess a total of four scorpions out of so 34 thralls i had 34 thralls out of the 38 creatures that i lost now um i was trying to get it to where it would tell me a building system where it would start it was there we there we go there we go i guess i wasn't um so it started, it looks like it started, um, this is what I hate about, I hate about this. Uh, it says 0, 023, um, 2345, okay, so we go back. So it took them, so they started um, 22, let's see here, um, 19, Third, okay, the fourth. So it looks like it looks like they started. Um, 
22, it's 23, the third, the third. So it looks like they started at, um, well, this goes a while back. So it took them, it took them, wow. So they started at uh, 9 o'clock, it looks what it looks like, or close to 9 o'clock. And then, so 9, 9, 10, 11, 12. So they got, they took them three hours to do what they, to do what they did here, roughly, um, from my understanding of this. It took them about three hours. And um, they didn't, they didn't, you know, they didn't really get a whole lot. Because if I go to unauthorized, um, or if I just go to un unauthorized entry, uh, you know, you can see where it says, uh, you know, uh, preservation box, you know, preservation box. And I actually looted all this stuff up off his body when he died. I mean, this is fish. You know, this is fish. Uh, so they, they, you know, so they really didn't get any, you know, hyena fur that I looted from the den. It's, you know, iron arrows, uh, iron bar, you know. So they did get a, a thousand branches. Uh, improved carpenter bench. Okay, the Silent Phoenix. So they got uh, what they get. They got um, feathers. They got thirteen hundred feathers and a thousand iron bars. They got some plant fibers. You know, uh, some hyena stuff. Oh, they got my Godbreaker. This is off my body right here. They looted this off my body. The hyena fur and the Godbreaker helmet. Uh, One hundred eighty-one iron bars. They, I mean, they really didn't. Explosive arrows, they got 14. Uh, dragon bone bow, uh, or dragon powder, 13. Uh, blunt, I don't think I had any dragon powder on me. Uh, blunt arrows, 83. You know, it's it's very, very little. Um, fish, 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 bear cub, wolf, uh, ice, ice. I mean, they didn't, they didn't get anything. Um... You know, the most valuable thing they got, I guess, is some feathers. But they raided this place for for three hours. And they so they got so little stuff that they were super pissed. Super pissed. And so they just tried to kill everything just to make an example. But they died. I think they probably died like 30 times because I would run in. As you watch the videos, I would just run in. And loot their bodies, and then run out and throw it in the safe. And, um, but you know, there's, it, but the, the thing to think about here is, you know, I'm not saying that explosives are too powerful, but um, there's a, in some aspects, is the argument could be made that they're too powerful. But I think the real problem is these Chinese clans are are cheese in the system and I'll use that I'll use that term uh you know favorably they you know really they're they're heavily exploiting but they're 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 um kind of manipulate manipulating the game in such a way that they're they're just punishing individuals you know and I, I this place is designed to be a mouse trap but there's a few things that came out of this that I realized um it was too easy to get in here and uh and that's that's with like seven doors that that weaved through this thing and uh, almost a million and a half hit points it was still too easy to get through this and that's even with the trap that was out front um and thralls archer thralls all through here archer thralls up there archer thralls in there and there and there it was still too easy uh anti climb fences there and there um you know, which takes a considerable amount of time to, to put together. Uh, even, you know, I even had like a pit trap right here uh, that may have gotten them. I would have loved to have seen if that if that worked on them. But they, they were able to get in there. Um, and then ultimately, the real, the real shame though is they had one thrall in Godbreaker and Annihilator. And the issue was that, that um, my thrall would attack them. But not a th attack the the thrall with the Godbreaker. So that thrall with the Godbreaker killed thirty four thralls 
one th- one of their thralls was able to kill 34 of my thralls without healing arrows. And so I'm I'm not sure how if there is an exploit or if they're if they're loading putting a load on the system to where the AI doesn't um, doesn't work like the AI doesn't respond. But he pretty much had free reign to go through and kill the entirety of the inside of my base with one one thrall. He left one thrall in here, and that one thrall was able to do finish everything off. And as you watch the videos, you'll be able to see. Um, and I even trapped the thrall in here at one point, and he had to bomb it to get the thrall out. But um, you know, there's there's uh, there needs to be more more traps in the game. There needs to be more systems and mechanisms for defending your base because, um, you know, just throwing more hit points at a solution isn't adequate. It's, you know, I could make that wall 30 thick. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. Like it's, um, and archer thralls have a, you know, if you can box an archer thrall in, that's probably your best defense mechanism, but they need... They need to have a um, that that needs to be their next major focus is is uh, base defense. They need to sit down, and maybe look at some other titles. You know, like Ark has um, uh, and Rust have traps. They have traps that kill players, and they have flamethrower torches. And you know, they need to have um, you know acid moats. You know, you need to be able to craft an acid moat. You know, and place it down like a pond. You know, a, a, a one block thick, four across acid moat. Um, you know, there there needs to be systems to be able to fight off the the Chinese horde because they are relentless and they use it is in their culture to uh, use every exploit available. And I, I captured a lot of it today. Uh, you know, recording recording this. You know, I got a couple good laughs, but. Um, you know, I I got set back a significant amount of time. That's what I lost. I didn't lose any items, but I probably lost 30 hours of playtime. Um, and you know, my my time is valuable. And so I, you know, even though I enjoy playing, I've kind of been reflecting, and I could put my time into other things that are a lot more rewarding. And uh, you know, I I could go to the gym and lift weights every day, or I could you know I could play other games and not be not lose that time to nothing. So it's one of those things that you have to ask yourself. And the developer, you know, the, the problem is, is if I post these videos on the Funcom form, they're, they'll, they'll lock them. They'll lock them and hide them. And, um, and they, they, they kind of, there's a denial of the truth. And, the, you know, there's no, there's no real community support. You know, if somebody posts a good idea, uh, from the staff in the community, you just get crickets. And that was one of the reasons why I started my YouTube channel is because, um, you know, some of this stuff needed to be shared and uh, you need to have an open and candid conversation about it and not be, not be blocked every time, uh, you, you, you know, you see something that's wrong. You know, you see something that's malice or, um, you know, somebody's hacking or exploiting and you, you witness it and you're like, uh, okay, I'm just going to OBS that and then upload it. And, uh, you know, the first, the first 20 or so. And so I, you know, the sad thing is, is I'm going to send this to Funcom and hopefully they'll, uh, you know, they'll ban this guy for, for exploiting, but they'll be back. I think what they have going on is I think they have access to a bit torrent and they bit torrent the game because if I go to the, uh, player list, you know, you see it's all, it's all Chinese. Me, me and Michelli right here are the only only Westerners on here. He's from Australia. I'm, from, you know, I'm from America. Chinese, 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 Chinese. Right? This is this is the the previous ATF and SS guilds that I think they were banned because they haven't been back. They just created new accounts. You know, they've just created new accounts and they they're immediately back. Like, um, you know, here's a new Chinese. And um, they're on this server to grief Americans. Anyways, I hope this. I hope there's some insight that comes out of this video. Um, you know, there there are some issues that need to be addressed. Like I don't know why one thrall, one of their thralls, could go through 17 of my thralls. And yes, he had the Godbreaker and the Annihilator, 
but also four of my thralls had the annihilator didn't even didn't even scratch that dude didn't even scratch him and you can watch those videos and you can just see kind of um I think it has something to do with load, loading down the server or maybe personally DDoSing me. I don't know. And and that way the thralls don't react and it kills it kills the AI. Um and the archers would were doing no damage. Like um the ar there was four archer five archers shooting at that guy the, the with the godbreaker. No damage. Um completely not relevant. So there, there needs to be some balancing. Um, I'm not saying that the Godbreaker is too powerful by no means. Um, I think what they need to do is they, that you know, the problem is, is you have to put gas mask on everything, and what that does is you lose a third of your armor value because of gas mask. And they need to, they need to incorporate um, more base defenses, and then they also need to incorporate. Um, you know, some more full plate armor sets that have, I mean, full plate or heavy plate or uh, or medium plate that have integrated gas mask or makes gas mask a kit. So I don't lose all my armor in a defensive scenario. And, you know, um, but the AI, this is, I think this was, this loss is really due to AI. I think the AI is, is the, the significant issue here is the thralls are, are not able to, um, really protect as as you know as nicely and the poison on the scorpions is um you know the animal damage and the poison damage is severely subpar you know that poison damage if you have an elite scorpion the, the eight eight thousand two hundred it should it should do crazy poison it doesn't have to do um you know a lot of damage but when that poison it should automatically stack do four or five stacks of poison on you as a valid base defense, you know, and the the little ones, they should just hit you and then put two stacks of poison, and uh, you know that way that way it's it's a it's a viable uh, option as a base defense. You know, your your um, rock nose, they should be immune to gas and bleeds. They're rocks. They're rocks. You can't make a rock bleed. They should be immune. So they need to go through. And dial in these these animal sets because right now animals are almost completely worthless, completely worthless. They just don't do enough damage. Um, you know the bears can have potential, and within the charge, they can push somebody into some palisades. But besides that, it's um, you know they they don't they're it's a it's just a waste of time. Your archer thralls and boxing them in and uh, fencing, kind of like how I did these up here. So I box I boxed in all my archers. Um I would like to see how I would I wish I could have kind of been like, you know, had a little CTC camera or like been a little birdie and watched and seen how they were able to kill all these thralls. Uh but if you box your thralls in, uh it makes them harder to kill. So I don't I don't know, maybe they just outranged them with poison arrows and killed them that way. I don't I don't know how they killed them. Um but yeah, you can see I I I I built, I built lots of archer towers, um, and I'm gonna go through and rebuild all this. I'm gonna go through and redo all of this, so this is not gonna be a big deal. I, I actually have the mats, but just kind of a kind of a, an after action review, you know, thoughts, uh, you know, what kind of what needs to take place, what needs to change, what can be improved. You know, I really would like to see acid moats. Uh, you know, it would be like, it could be three across a three by one thickness and it like a, basically like how you have the fountains and ponds. Um, but they're, they're just acid moats. Um, you know, they're, they're gas, they're gas moats. And so you could just, you know, put them in front of your buildings and it, it would, uh, create some standoff and it would be something that's passive. And those effects already exist in the game. Um. And you know, scorpions and the animals need need to really dial in their ability sets uh, and their attributes a lot more because they just they're they're worthless. I mean, I love them for for their uniqueness, but they're they're just not capable at all. And they just you can kill a whole bunch of them with just with a couple of orbs. So, anyways, I think I'm going to close this video off here. I hope you get some insight out of it. You know, always please please uh, you know comment. Tell me what you think. You know, give me some feedback if you know something. If you know a strategy or a tip, put it in the comments. Um, you know, I'm not I'm not quitting the game, but I've kind of been I've been thinking about 
how how better to use my time because this this the problem with this is it is, it is just a time sink and because of the because of the um you know my work day i I really don't have any options. I don't get to do anything in debt about it. And I'll almost bet money that they'll start DDoSing the server within the next hour or two. Uh, because that's typically how it goes. When they get done t playing, they just DDoS the server for everybody else. Anyways, um, you know, be critical. And I'll see you in the next video.